Welcome to Headline News 24-7. Please click like and subscribe. After Trump slams Iran for attacking U.S. drone, their president comes crawling back with an offer. In recent months, Iran has become more and more aggressive. It started with a very bold and stupid attack on a civilian Saudi oil tanker. Luckily, they were caught in the act. Then Iran shot down our American drone, accusing us of flying over their airspace. Yeah, they are asking for trouble. It would appear that the rogue nation is trying to rattle the world's cage once again. Well past U.S. presidents may have cowered before Iran's aggression, but not our president. Not Donald Trump. He's a bit different than the others. After the drone fiasco, the president slammed their tiny regime, promising stiff retribution if they continued their actions. Here's his tweet, in case you missed it. It's classic Trump, and I love him for it. To Iranian President Rouhani, never ever threaten the United States again, or you will suffer consequences, the likes of which few throughout history have ever suffered before. We are no longer a country that will stand for your demented words of violence and death. Be cautious. Get him, Trump. Man, I love it when the president gets fired up about keeping America safe. It brings a warm feeling to my heart. It's about time we had a president who was willing to do whatever it takes to keep Americans safe instead of bending over and bowing to every other world leader he sees. Jeez, what an embarrassment Obama was. I'll move on to happier things. After Trump's harsh tone and no BS attitude, Iran's president is singing a different tune. Check it out from Breitbart. Iranian President Hassan Rouhani said on Sunday that Iran is prepared to deal with the U.S. government if sanctions are lifted. All of a sudden, Iran suddenly wants to negotiate. Before, it was all threats and insults. But after a few months of strict sanctions and tough talk from Trump, they want to make a deal. Iran is obviously hurting from those U.S. sanctions because their number one demand is for the sanctions to be lifted. Then they'll negotiate. But wait, not so fast, Iran. You're a major bully and a confirmed state sponsor of terrorism in recent decades. You've often vowed to wipe Israel, our ally, off the map. And now, new reports indicate you may have never stopped building nuclear weapons. So, my advice to Trump is don't drop those sanctions just because Iran asked nicely. Actually, I wouldn't be surprised if Trump demands talks before sanctions are lifted. First, make Iran sign a strict deal, and then we'll see about removing the sanctions. Trump is no fool. He's got Iran right where he wants them. Now, it's all a matter of timing. Good thing we have a master negotiator in the White House, huh? That was the news. We thought you might be interested in knowing about this. Please click like and subscribe. Thank you.